One of the most popular questions I get is where should I build my portfolio? And personally, I find that Framer is a good one to consider if you don't want to code and you also want to highly customize your portfolio. Today, I'm going to show you how you can take a design from Figma and port it over to Framer super fast. So here I have a case study that I designed all in Figma. I'm gonna go ahead and port it over to Framer. So I'm gonna select this frame and then I'm gonna to go to my plugins and select Figma to HTML with Framer. You notice how it's copying all my layers. Okay, so now that I am in Framer, I can go ahead and do Command V to paste my design within Framer like this. It might take a second. Notice how my design is cut off. And so in order to fix that, I can go ahead and click this frame and then hit fit content like this so that it magically fits all the content within my page. Next, I'm going to make my phone screen work. So notice how it's really cool. It already has ported over to the right side, but the proportions aren't quite right. And so in order to do this, I'm going to set the width of this case study layer to be max of 100%. I'm also gonna do that for this layer in here as well max of 100%. So notice how it's almost there, but the text in here is not fitting within the area. And that's because I need to set the text so that it's all filling the container. Unfortunately, this currently does not port over directly from Figma, but that's okay. It doesn't take that long to go through and change these different elements to all be fill. You can also select the elements within your layers on the left side, and it might be a little faster. So notice here how now most of my layers are within the frame that I have. So let me check this one. So this one is fill. And so now if I want to publish this as a website, all I have to do is hit publish up here on the top right. And then because I published this before, it says update, but I'm gonna go ahead and hit update. And now when I open up this link, you'll notice I have my website like this, which is pretty cool. And I can also adjust the size like this. And you notice that it works for mobile sizing. So I hope you try it out. I thought this was pretty cool and it's a really great way to put together your portfolio really quickly.